Okay, here we go. Welcome back to Roulette Profit and Stop here on YouTube. Do not forget to hit the subscribe button. And if you like the content, give it a thumbs up and let me know what you like about it and where you think I'm going to get to on this uh, on this setup. Am I going to make it all the way to the end to 100 sessions and actually generate profit? Or am I going to get take some hits along the way and end up losing my bankroll? What, what are your thoughts? I'm going to do another one of these where I'm going to be withdrawing money at um, shorter intervals and I won't do as many as a hundred sessions I'll do sh I'll do a lot less than that but I'll show you a variation of this and a different casino different tables and uh, yeah so on this one I'm going to look at the the sheet we're going to update the sheet so uh, the last ending session was 228.80 so There you go. So now this is going to be session number 21, looking to make £4 minimum profit. And yeah, so 228 to 232. 232.80 is what I'm looking to achieve here in the balance. I'll bring you back to the sheet, hopefully, once I've achieved that. So I'm going to use a different tool today. I'm using this hot and cold gameplay. And I've moved it to the right hand side of the screen because I need to bring up the uh, information on the left hand side of the screen. So click to play, input my balance, 228.80, submit. I'm going to play the minimum chip value for this table, 10 pence. So my risk here is only 10 pounds, 20 pence. I'm going to give it 20 spins maximum with a progression. And if I lose for 20 spins and I do not get a single hit, it's going to cost me 10.2 units or £10.20. Submit that. Just verify these are game details are correct. If you need to edit that, just click on the edit button and it'll take you back a page. Click submit. So this is the betting criteria. So what we need to do is bring up the chart and also set the neighbour number to one, bring up the chart and then set the history of the spins from 1000 down to the minimum, which is on this table it's 100. On your table it might be 50. So go down to 50 if it's on your table. Um, but the lowest, whatever the lowest is. We're now looking at the hot numbers here. 31, 28, 2, 13. And we're also going to look at the last six entries. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. And we're going to count how many of those last six numbers have hit as a hot number. 30, is it hot? No. 13, yes, that's a hit. 24, no. 14, 13, 34. So there's only one hot number. It's number 13. If, if that's hot, then we can pick a hot number. No, it's not. So we've got a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So num now number 13's in the 6th position. The last 6 spins is the 6th position. If there's no hot numbers, if there's no hot numbers in the last 6 spins, we play the cold number gameplay. And the cold number gameplay is just below the hot number instructions there on the tool. It says if there's less than 2 hot numbers, in the last six spins, set the history to 200, sorry, 300 or 200, and select the coldest number. Right, if 12 is not hot, which it's not going to be, then there's no hot numbers in that last six, six entries. So we go to 200, and we pick the coldest number, which is 21. <clears throat> so we bet number 21. We set the autos. I'm going to set the autos for 20. I don't need to go for 20. Um, click that message. Select number 21. Click the tick. So I'm playing the cold side of the hot and cold gameplay here. Um, so the, the hot criteria didn't match. So we're now playing for the cold. So I'm going to click lost on the tool. Click repeat on the tool. And it's automatically going to place my bet again on the casino because I've set it up for 20 spins covering number 20, 1, 2 and 4. So this setup, um, on, the, on the cold number gameplay, which is what I'm currently playing, of the hot and cold gameplay, the cold side of it, this typically gives me a win within 11 spins of the 20 spins I'm going to give it. Although the other day when I played this, 
I didn't get a single hit on the cold number gameplay for 20 spins, so I actually ended up losing. There you go, 21. Boom. Click one. I've just made three pounds. It took two spins. I'm going to turn off the autos. And uh, I've got now 231.80. Click continue. Congratulations, profit and stops. So this is what it goes like when it goes well, pretty much. So, second spin in, 10 pence stake. Start with 228.80. And I made three pound profit. I'm only looking to make four pound profit. That's pretty good. So I'm now going to change tables. I'm going to set this same tool up on this table, which is a twenty pence stake table. So menu, click to play, put in a balance of two thirty one eighty. Submit that twenty p stake. So my risk here, if I lose for twenty spins without a hit. It's going to cost me £20.40, so 20.4 units. Submit that. Submit that. So I bring up the chart. Reduce the number down to 100. Look at the last... I'll reduce that neighbour number down to 1. Look at the hot numbers, 5, 36, 26, 2. And we're looking at last 6 entries. So we count the last 6 entries, including that number 10 that's just landed. Wait for it to drop in. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. It's 35 hot. No, it's 12. No. 36, yes. 5, yes, that's two numbers. 9, no. So 5 is the most recently hitting hot number. That would be the bet. So that's my bet. Put the autos for 20. Click yes. 5 is the bet. This is now the hot side of the hot cold number gameplay. There was two hot numbers in the last six spins. Number 5 was the most recently hitting hot number. So that's the bet basically. So I click lost, click repeat. So I've got the autos set for 20 spins, covering number 5, 10, and 24. And this is the hot side of the hot cold gameplay. Now, if this this typically hits within 13 spins of the 20 spins. So we're on. 5, 10, 24. This is spin number 2. 20 pence per number. Right, this number 22 is a great number. So number 10, 5, and 24. So this is now spin number 3 coming up. And we've got an absolute fantastic chance. Because if you look at number 22, it's the neighbour of 9. And look at 9 in the history. Look at where number 9 went to. 9 went to 10. And that's what typically happens on this game, on this table. Um, 22, 18, well, 22, 31, 9, all go down to 10, 5, 24, usually. Well, it's gone the opposite, so it did the opposite, which is fine. 15 likes to go back to 15 or across to 24 or the neighbour of 24. Sometimes it's 16, so I might get a miss by one position on this spin. But these tables play the same all the time. A bit like the online slots. They have cycle of um cycle of events that they do. Oh, that went a little bit too too far over. Uh spin five coming up. So eleven likes to go to the neighbour number of eleven. So if this table's playing uh two pockets to the side of the last number out. Then we want it to land on number 8 or number 33. 8 or 33 lands, I think we might be pretty good. Unless this lands now. Oh, there you go, 10, sweet. That's £4.20 profit. Thank you very much. Take off the autos. Congratulations, profit and stop. Statistics. I've made £7.20. Happy days. So, what I'm going to do now is end this stream because I've just played another tool. One of, my, one of my tools, hot and cold. I played the cold gameplay first on a different table, hit on my second spin. I played the hot gameplay on this table and I hit on my fifth spin. So, I've made £7.20 profit in total. What I'm going to do is bring up the, the Google Sheet and input my new balance of 236. Which is pretty good, isn't it? So now I've got 
236 minus the 15 gives me a profit of 221 if I withdraw everything now. I'll come back later and do um, session number 22 of 100. And uh, yeah, I'll just get through as many sessions as I can today and upload as much as I can as, as possible. Um, yeah, thanks again for your time. Don't forget to slap that subscribe button. I'll be back later to upload, upload more content and chip away at this casino and try and make as much, take as much off it as I can when I can. Thanks again for your time. See you soon.